Hey everybody, I'm Jackie Jing, and today, filming wrapped on Star Wars Episode 9, J.J. Abrams announced that by tweeting out this photo showing Daisy Ridley, John Boyega, and Oscar Isaac in costume hugging each other. Abrams wrote, quote, It feels impossible, but today wrapped photography on Episode 9. There is no adequate way to thank this truly magical crew and cast. I'm forever indebted to you all. This is the first clear photo we have seen of the main characters in episode 9, and so it's our first chance to see what their costumes look like. Ray's outfit is similar to how she's appeared in previous movies, but now she's back to her hairstyle from Force Awakens. We can also see a band covering the wound she got after fighting Supreme Leader Snoke's guards with Kylo Ren in The Last Jedi. She's also carrying her signature staff, so it's clear that's not a part of the past that she's going to let die. John Boyega's hair is longer than we've seen it in the film so far, which seems to confirm that there will be a time jump in between The Last Jedi and Episode 9. Now, the interesting thing about Poe's look is that it seems to line up with recent leaked concept images from the movie, as does Rey's. We won't show you that here, but if these costumes match that leak, it stands to reason that the rest of the images in the leak are legit as well. Finally, let's talk about what planet the scene they were shooting here could take place on. Severine from the end of Solo seems like an outside contender just based on landscape. Tatooine could be possible, and we haven't seen that iconic desert planet in this trilogy yet, so maybe Rey is performing some kind of funeral rite for Luke Skywalker there. But the likeliest planet for this to be seems like Jakku. Perhaps just as the final film of the original trilogy returned to the hero's home planet, this new trilogy will wrap up with a return to where it all started. The question is, why? Some fans reacted negatively to The Last Jedi's revelation that Rey has no significant lineage, so maybe JJ is changing course, prepping to unveil a storied family history. We'll have to wait until December to find out. But what do you think of this photo? Tell us in the comments section. And check out our discussion on whether Episode 9 will beat Avengers Endgame at the box office, as well as what movies we're most excited for this year. And as always, be sure to follow and subscribe to IGN wherever you like to watch.